AC Motioners, how you guys doing, man? Happy 2015. I thought I'd start off uh, start off the year with a little video for you guys. It's been a long time since I've done it. Um, Lee has I've been speaking with him on the phone. He's helped me immensely on my swing, and I just want to hopefully help you guys out as well. I'm here in the old doctor's office. Take a look what we got here, and here's what we got. We have, let me see if I can find it now. We have the old Hogan plane of glass, except for this plane of glass is not extending all the way up through. It's mainly going to just allow our club head to work through. So the pane of glass works with any type of backswing. We just don't want to break it, you know, going back. We don't want to break it coming through. So that's the whole scenario behind that. So let me see if we can get this situated out here. Get this lined up. Get the doctor working. Hopefully it's going to be a quick video. Doesn't look like it's going to be. Guess I should have. Sorry guys. Hmm, it looks like it might be working. So anyways, here we have our pane of glass right here. Um, what Lee helped me on Two things real quick here hopefully we can get it real quick one thing I noticed is his grip you know when he told us his right grip his grips he just reaches out and grabs it okay. grabs it reach it out grabs it okay well if you realize when he reaches out and grabs it and you actually look down this thing looks like it's underneath your hands underneath. In all reality, it feels like your hands underneath, except for your back of your palm is pretty much level. But when you look down on the top, it feels like it's underneath, almost like AKA Mo Norman, you know. And then the same thing is his other hands coming down. His left hand's doing the same thing. So, anyways. Reach down, and when you grab it, it totally feels like it's underneath, even though it's not. What I'm going to discuss with that is when you do that, and I'm underneath here, now the backswing allows for that motion. If we want to say hammer motion, that's fine. But it allows that swing, the back swing, to go right here on this Magic 45. All I'm doing is just folding, folding my arm, okay? And with my hand gripping the club, because my hand gripping the club, it allows that 45. So all I'm doing is folding it up. Obviously, you guys see my swing. I can't get it up to the top. I don't know why, but I can sure do it in the practice swings. Get it up here, and all I'm going to do is push it back down. Get it up here, push from the top, straight down. Okay, now what our little pane of glass is right here. Should be at a 45, but my contraption I made cut myself short, and I didn't feel like redoing it. But what this is, is this pane of glass allows us to take that backswing. I have my grip, fold my arm, it's not going out, it's not breaking in, it's not even coming in. I just fold it guys, and I'm right up here at the top. Start my downswing, I'm just going to push. Starting the downswing up here, I'm pushing. Okay, now when I'm pushing down, guys, 
I'm the club orientation is changing from this position and I push that club orientation changes from here to 180 degrees opposite direction it's pointing at the target as soon as I push it's pointing away from the target okay so I'm pushing it guess what now when I push it down right in here it's gonna come through this pane of glass from this orientation so as it gets down pretty much parallel you're gonna let the club what you want to do is you're going to push it from here. So as you push it down and through, this is where the stand-up occurs, guys. So you take it here, you're going to let it fall, gravity, which Lee talked about, or push it down is the same motion. Push it down, push it through. Push it to the completion, all the way, guys. So again, from here, it's coming straight down, and you're going to push it, guys, from here, you're pushing it all the way down. So when I'm pushing it down, sorry, man, when I'm pushing it down, the club is standing up. Pushing it down, club stands up, complete it all the way through. Guys, that's it. Good luck. Um, thanks for everyone keeping that C motion side up going. You guys are still on the train, so I just thought I would add a little caboose to it. Hit me up if you guys have any questions, you know, and good luck, and hopefully we all find it. You know, I'm on it right now. My placard says in. It's been in for about a month. I'm hitting the ball solid, 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 and it's all due to that push. Changing the club orientation from up here, back down, pushing it down, pushing it down. Push, 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 push. The thing's pointing at me. Push, 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 push. Push, 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 push to finish. Take care, guys. Love you.